Danielle moved on to secondary school and she was actually at the same school as Dom. And although they knew of each other, they didn't actually become close friends then. Then several years down the line, after a little Facebook stalking, Dom decided to make contact with Danielle and see if she wanted to go out on a date, which I believe is exactly five years ago today. As time passed, their relationship became stronger and stronger and they have grown well together. They've forged successful careers and they've set up a beautiful family home. And they brought us our wonderful grandson, Lucas, to whom you are brilliant parents. Dan and Dom, not only do you make a magnificent couple, but you clearly are best of friends. And I wish you many happy years of marriage. I think we can all agree that Danielle looks stunning today. I can't put into words how happy I am to call you my wife. We met at secondary school in September 2002, 19 years ago. We've been together for five years, so she took 14 years of convincing. <laughs> Sometimes I think she's still not sure. <laughs> I remember looking across at you at a restaurant in London and thinking to myself, I have to marry you. This was only two or three weeks after we got together, but I already knew. The first time I told Danielle that I love her, it was in a bar in Camden before we had kids and we can go out on the weekend. <laughs> her response wasn't, I love you too. It wasn't, thank you. It was, did you say that by mistake? <laughs> it was definitely on purpose. <laughs> Danielle, anyone that has ever met you knows how lucky I am. And anyone that has ever met me knows how much I love you. It's been the, the biggest privilege of my life to watch the woman I love become a mum. And you're amazing. Danny, you're perfect. And I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. 